Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Unusual Findings, where we've pressed on to Act 2, and we now find ourselves in the New Frontier Court, because the alien has come in here and gone on a rampage, so we're going to have a look around. Uh, I imagine we're going to have to fix this, we had a brief look at it at the end of the last episode, but for now, let's head on. Oh my god, what is all this? Again, more of this weird blue liquid. Do you think this is alien blood? If it is... He has been bleeding a lot lately. Yeah, I don't know if it is or not. Can we, like, take any of this or anything? It's spilled all over. There's no way to grab it. Uh, okay. Do we have anything we can maybe, like, wipe on it? Displaying that we belong to the booze and boob club there isn't going to help that much. I mean, I was really trying to use it to wipe some of the goo stuff on, but okay. Everything is a mess. Looks pretty much like my room. <laughs> nice. It's a big mark on the wall. I'm not sure if it was made with the blades or with the laser. But it looks like the battle here was intense. Yeah, I mean, I'm not... I'm not sure if we're going to actually find anyone alive in this place. So we can go this way to the hallway, or we can carry on. I, I think maybe we go in here. Oh, God. There's a fire. Okay. Uh, there's a duck. It's the room air duct. Someone's stuck in there. Cleaning cupboard. It's an iron cleaning cupboard. And it's leaking some liquid. Oh, is that what that green Did stuff is? Did I tell is? you that when I grow up, I want to be a janitor? How is that compatible with your dream of becoming a mobster? <laughs> well, both are in the cleaning business. Uh, I see. Touché. Uh, I see it. Can we open this? And now oh. it's open. What a mess. What the hell is that? Like cleaning a sprayer? It's an empty sprayer. Okay, it's got nothing in it. Can we open this side? It's already open. We cannot. Okay. And there is no reason to close the doors when you're on a rescue mission. True. Um, what's this? A card reader. Oh, this That's where you're supposed to scan the security card to enter different rooms in this building. So we've got all wow. this... This technology is so sci-fi. It is. You know what is sci-fi? The frickin' robot alien. This is just a magnetic card. I mean, do we know that it's robotic? The flames are intense. We must find a way to stop this fire. All right, maybe like turning on a sprinkler system or something. Can we talk to this lady? Hey! Oh, thank God! Humans! Yes! Help me out! Can you open that door? We can try! Um, can you open the door from the room you're in? Obviously not, because she's asking us, but we'll ask. Can you open the door from the room you're in? No! Okay, did you already try pressing all the switches in there? Did you already try pressing all the switches there? Uh, give me a minute. Did she actually not? The door is still closed. What did that do? Yes, and the lights are oh, I was going to say, I thought the lights went off. All right, well, are there more survivors? Are there more survivors? I don't know. Okay, do you know where we can find a fire extinguisher then? Do you know where we can find a fire extinguisher? No, I have no idea. You know where we can find a card? You know where we can find a card to open the door? At the reception, all ID cards are there. Okay, fine, the reception. Give us a minute. Is it, is Hurry. it, is it just me or does this, this fire animation look kind of weird? Like, I, I don't, it's, everything else is like pixel art -y, but the fire doesn't look pixel art -y to me, which I don't know, maybe it's just the way I'm looking at it. Just a bit weird. Right, so the reception is, is here, right? So where would the cards be? Is there anything this way? Oh, do you know what? We didn't come down this way. Oh, that's because there's nothing there. <laughs> Right, so she said it should be at the reception, but I mean, unless there's like, unless it's like in the security. Oh, hang on, hidden cabinet. The monitor is fixed to the desk. Okay, so I wonder if we maybe couldn't look at this without speaking to that lady. What I get from reading the stickers on this wooden cabinet 
is that it stores the security cards of this facility's personnel. Okay, when it's open it up. The cabinet is locked with the key. Ah. I can't open them with my bare hands. Of course it is. Okay, um... I mean, maybe the wrench. That doesn't have number six bolts. No, the wrench can only, you know, deal with bolts. Can this woman tell us anything else? Maybe this has number hey! six bolts. Open that door! I'm trying. We are on it! Um Okay, there's nothing Give us a minute! There's nothing else about that, so Hurry! Let's just see if we can remove this cover. Oh, I think we can. Oh, we can go down to a laboratory. Okay, so we've got places to go here. We can go down to this laboratory, or we can progress on this way. We've got more of this blue liquid now. Uh, so there's more of it here. Again, more of this weird blue liquid. Do you think this is... Okay, if it is? We heard about the alien blood. Oh, no, actually, this is a dead end. Okay, so we actually have to go that way. <laughs> Fine. Let's go down to the laboratory. Okay, what have we got here? A weird machine. Oh my god, there's like different calcium, silicon, sulfur, mixer, discard. Alright, let's have a look at this. It's a weird looking mechanical thing. It has a lot of levers. Seems like some kind of mixer machine. Yeah, I'm guessing we're going to need to know the right combination of things to mix. Oh, there's a container slot. Below there is an inscription that reads container slot. Okay, so, does this go in there? Yep, okay, let's just see if we can, like... One unit of calcium added. Okay. One unit to silicon added. Fine. One unit to sulfur added. And then we've got mixer. Okay. Native substance mixing with local ingredients. It's doing something. Container cleaned. Filling container with new formula. Process complete. You can now withdraw your container. Okay. Now the sprayer is full of this thing. Okay, we've also got like a discard one. Cool! Now I have a sprayer full of that thing. Okay, what, what is it? The sprayer contains the liquid I concocted in that weird lab machine. Right, so we don't get any sort of... Oh, lab notes, what's this? There are some research notes. The subject is native substance and its applications ah we might need that can we oh my god what is all this and there's a cable let's take that that might help us fix upstairs where the machine is oh my god mixing native substance with diverse local elements will result in solutions of the most diverse properties uh two calcium plus one um one silicon plus HG is great fertilizer. Disinfectant, potent biocorrosive, active fire extinguisher, lubricant, CA blood. Gravitational fields of enough charge can make some enhanced metals hover and create an electromagnetic field that could be used as a shield. However, the electromagnetic field can be disabled quickly and easy depending on the enhanced metal used to generate the field. For instance, liquid hydrogen can be used dis to disable a gold-enhanced electromagnetic field. Sodium bicarbonate can be used to disable an alum aluminium-based electromagnetic field. Or chlora of sodium can be used to disable a zinc-enhanced electromagnetic field. Ask Peter about other metals he was able to enhance. Prove the power of a laser gun. Adding a ruby to the battery slot is... okay. Laboratory mixer isn't working properly. I tried cleaning the mixer and it didn't work. 
tried changing the battery, it didn't work. We then tried enhanced zinc to supercharge it, and yet nothing. I think we should add deuterium to the regulator and see what happens. I fixed it, it was just a dead cockroach in the motor contacts. Okay. So they're doing, like, work on vegetables. Denied my rays. Huh. Okay. Well, what's this? The chalkboard reads, Native Substance. And has a series of elements pointing to it. That SI stands for silicone, CA for calcium, S for sulfur, and C12H22O11. What is that? What the hell is that? Sucrose. Oh, sucrose. And that is? Regular sugar. Yeah. All right, well, this door, can we go through here? This door was heavily damaged. Guess not. So I'm guessing we're going to have to make the fire extinguisher stuff, right? I can't move it. Not a single inch. So I burnt out machine. The creature sure did a lot of damage here. Can we... Yeah, I'm starting to suspect he doesn't like this place. Yeah. You are right. The question is why. The machine is broken. Any parts or anything? Oh, apparently not. Oh, we can't actually go this way. Okay. Um, so let's just consult that note we've got again here. <clears throat> so to make an active fire extinguisher, you need one CA and three S. So that's cal one, one calcium and three uh, sulfur. So let's, let's put this back in. We'll discard what's in there. Let's give this a try. Container cleaned. Process complete. You can now withdraw your container. So we need one calcium. One unit of calcium added. And then we need three sulfur, right? One unit to sulfur added. One unit to sulfur added. One unit to sulfur added. So that should be it. Okay. Native substance mixing with local ingredients. Container cleaned. Filling container with new formula. So I wonder if you don't actually need to use the discard. Process complete. You can now withdraw your container. Because it seems it... Okay. Now the sprayer is full of this thing. So this should be something that would extinguish the fire, hopefully. Cool! Now I have a sprayer full of that thing. Thank you. All right, up we go. Uh, before we put that out, <clears throat> I just want to try using this cable over here. I don't know if we can trust this lady or not. So. Ah, yeah, this is a thing. Okay, so this should connect up, I guess, the coffee machine. Okay. Now this thing should stop short-circuiting. Yeah, but that doesn't mean that suddenly everything will start working fine. I mean, this place was heavily damaged by an unknown alien weapon. True. Can we at least use this now? This isn't working. It has no power. Okay, so it hasn't restored power to that, but it might have helped something. Let's put this fire out. Or at least attempt to. Could you imagine if we mixed it wrong and this was like something that makes it explode? Huh, that was easy. Hey, this thing's great to stop fire. Yeah. All right, well. Uh, oh, we got the sprayer back, so I wonder if we are going to need to potentially mix something else up. Oh, there's more fire. Can we... Oh, do we need... Okay, so we've got the door. There is a woman on the other side of the door. There is. So, how are we going to get this... Hard 
from this locked thing. We need a key. And we don't have a key. Is there anything in the notes about a key? Uh, I don't think so. Disinfectant, fertilizer, biocorrosive? Maybe. I mean, silicon, sulfur, and sucrose could maybe use a biocorrosive to, like, burn through it. Gravitational field, I doubt, is going to help us out here. Uh, that's about the mixer. Seeds. I don't think there's any stuff there. Alright, there must be a key laying around somewhere then. The question is where? Where would the key be? I, and it's just like some weird thing that's like in the vending machine. This is weird. There's no place to put money into this coffee vending machine. Ah. Uh, that's why it's free coffee. Some companies do that. It makes sense. Spend some cents on coffee to earn some extra dollars in productivity. Mm. Everybody wins. Yeah, too bad this one has no power. Yeah, see, I'm wondering if perhaps, actually, that's not what's in there. Maybe there's something hidden in there. Let's see if we can get her to press those buttons again and see if that does anything. Hey! Open that door! We are on it! Can you press those buttons again? Did you already try pressing all the switches there? Uh, give me a minute. Let's just see if anything else happens. Right, the lights are back the on. The door is still closed. Yes, and the lights are on. Right, let's see if... Give us a minute! Hurry! Let's see if putting the lights on is going to change anything. Anything different out here? No. But let's just see if that's, like, allowed the power to come Looks back pretty. on the machine. Yes! Okay. Okay, coffee is actually coming up. It gave me a cup with sugar in it. Ah. This thing is messed up. Okay. I told you, even if we fix the power... Um... Oh, I don't know if this is... I don't know if this is another one of those choices. So as if you know everything. Yeah, you're a smart guy, we get it. Can you calculate the odds of leaving this place in one piece? I mean, neither of these <laughs> seem particularly nice. Um, yeah, you are a smart guy. We get it. Can you calculate the odds of leaving this place in one piece? It's hard to put that in numbers. So... I'll go with between not too good and terribly bad. All right, well, we've got sugar, so we're going to have to mix up the the bio thing. Bio corrosive or whatever it is, but we'll do that in the next one because we're out of time. So as always, thank you very much for watching. A big thank you to my patrons, Arcades Games, Wayne Nate, Tony Nerdy, Paul from the Phantom Fellows, Lyle, Barry Aldridge, Hobo, Numinous, Kumadin, Paul Leone, Flossy the Sheep, John Com 555 and Chrissy, and I'll see you next time.